Do you know where you are in your coaching business right now? And are you focusing on the right things to grow it? In this video, I want to share with you the three phases of a coaching business growth path and exactly what you should be focused on to move to the next level. If you try to jump a stage or skip a stage, chaos and overwhelm can happen. So it's important to know where you are in the moment right now and what you should be doing next. My name is Milana Lashinsky and I've been offering coaching programs for over two decades. I learned a lot about what clients want, how they get results and what stops coaches from offering coaching programs to clients or to groups. So after creating and delivering over a hundred coaching programs, I decided to build a tool that makes it easy and that's how Coaching Genie uh, was created. It simplifies the whole group coaching experience and it makes your programs a lot more valuable. If you want to learn more, go to coachinggenie.com. So let's talk about the three stages of business growth for coaches. Stage one is emerge. Stage two is build. Stage three is scale. If you are currently in the emerge stage, you are probably focusing on getting one-on-one -on -one coaching clients. Your focus is on getting clients. And that means you are working on things like making sure you have a niche, you understand who you're trying to target, who your ideal client is, right? And because you're trying to attract your ideal clients and understand your niche, you're probably also working on your messaging. What is your big idea? What's your core message? Your own website and communicating your messaging on your website. So that's the other thing that you are probably working on if you are in the emerge um, stage where you are putting together your website to announce to the world, this is what I do and this is how I can help you. The next thing you're probably focusing on is getting as many people as you can on free sessions, those free strategy sessions where you um, either give sample coaching sessions or you call them discovery sessions where you find out what um, people need. You also uh, focus on getting referrals. So you're telling everybody you know, hey, I'm a coach, this is what I do. Send me clients if you know anybody who needs my help. And the last thing that you're probably working on, whether you are aware of it or not, is confidence building. So uh, w as a new coach, uh, it's very easy to kind of hold back because you're not yet confident in your skills, in the value you offer. So confidence building is happening in this emerge stage. Now each stage um, comes with its own challenges and milestones. So the challenges of the emerge phase is the fact that there is an ocean of other coaches out there and you need to find a way to separate yourself. How are you different? How are you distinct, unique? What makes you better? The milestone of this phase is that you start realizing that you actually have value to offer and you're starting to identify top issues that your clients bring to you. So that's your eMERGE stage. The focus is on getting clients and everything you do is really focused on getting more private coaching clients. Stage two is build. This is the stage where you're starting to realize that you have a lot of expertise and knowledge base and you want to start leveraging it. So this is the stage where you start gathering all of your coaching tools and resources. You start building your coaching toolbox or coaching library. You also start building a mailing list because you want to start marketing to an audience of your ideal clients. So you're starting to market to groups. Um, you also will start uh, recording any repeatable teachings, any workshops, any trainings, um, any content that you feel that you will reuse in the future and that contains your expertise, something that you can transfer without being there personally. You also start creating your own coaching program, which is huge because that's something that allows you to get to the next level. And maybe even in this stage, you're starting your own group coaching program. Could be a small group, it could be a large group, but you're starting to really work with multiple people or also known as one-to-many as opposed to one-to-one. -one. And as I said, every stage comes with its own challenges and milestones. The challenges of a build phase is that you have to find time to create your coaching program because you're just so busy working with clients one-on-one -on -one, you might 
find it difficult to uh, create it, to fill it and to deliver it. The milestones of this phase are awesome because you have your first coaching program and you realize that you never have to teach the same content again. And you can simply send your material to your clients or to groups. Um, the other milestone that will probably happen if it hasn't happened yet in the merge stage is that you're gonna hire your first virtual assistant, your first VA, because you realize you can do it all on your own. Let's talk about the last, the third stage of business growth as a coach, and that is scale. So with scaling, you are really starting to create more revenue streams. Uh, you're starting to get bigger groups, more clients, more programs. You're starting to really build um, courses, mastermind groups, membership, an academy maybe, and other scalable programs. So your focus is really on scaling beyond you know, one-on-one -on -one beyond small group. Your one-on-one -on -one coaching service becomes a premium service, which means you can charge more for it, and you do less of it because you're focused really on scaling and being able to deliver your expertise to more clients in less time. You also start uh, realizing that you need a system that allows you to manage your programs, clients, and content. So that's something that becomes critical at the scale stage because without a system, you really can't move forward. You're going to be too overwhelmed um, and it's going to get chaotic for you, right? And then the last thing that you want to probably focus on is hiring a few more people for your team, not just a VA or more virtual assistants, but people who can actually help you grow your business and support your clients. Maybe even start creating your own team of coaches, your own coaching team who could deliver your programs that you created to your clients and you just you know your role changes from a coach to being a creator a visionary an entrepreneur that's the other thing that really um, changes now the challenges of uh, you know scaling a business at the scale stage is that scaling usually comes with more complexity you're getting busier you have a lot more moving pieces to manage so the thought of having more clients might feel like it creates um it can create a lot of chaos and overwhelm in your life so you need a team you need a system and the milestone of this uh, scale stage is that you're starting to realize that you're no longer trading time for money you need to disrupt that connection where more time spent with clients does not equal more money more time growing your business does not equal more revenue in your business. So everything you do in scaling your business, you're actually starting to ask yourself, how can I do less and make more? Now, whether you are in, uh, in the emerge stage, build stage or scale stage, um, Coaching Genie, the platform for running your groups and programs and, and managing your content, it can really help you get organized and build a dynamic coaching portal that will grow with your business. And if you're not using Coaching Genie yet, uh, go to coachinggenie.com and see how it can supercharge your coaching programs, allow you to go from emerge to build, from build to scale stages in your business. It's very easy to use. You can set up your first group, your first course, your first modules in just a few minutes, and it will become your go-to platform for delivering your coaching content, programs, and courses. And if you're ready to start multiplying your revenue streams by repurposing, leveraging your content to create multiple um, types of programs, then uh, go to coachinggenie.com and check out the free demo. Thanks for watching. This is Milana Lashinsky and I will see you next time.